Do you know today, father forgot to give me communion and mass when I was on the sofa. Then after mass, he went to that locker and gave me communion. It's not a locker. It's called tabernacle. Tabo what now? Tabernacle. What's that? Go ask Alicia. Okay. When we enter the church, our gaze is naturally drawn to the tabernacle, the heart of the sanctuary. It is not just a mere fixture, it holds the essence of our faith. Picture the ancient Israelites journeying through the wilderness with the portable tabernacle, a tangible symbol of God's presence among them. Today, in a modern world, the same presence endures, manifested in the Eucharist within the tabernacle. For us, the tabernacle is a sacred vessel containing the very body and blood of Christ. Its placement within the church speaks to its significance. Whether in the sanctuary or a chapel, it calls us to reverence and adoration. As we approach the tabernacle, we are reminded of God's love for us. Here, God is really present to us in the bread and wine, inviting us to partake in His grace, to find solace and strength in His presence and carrying his life out into the world. I hope that answers your question.